friends, good evening, hope you are well. Let's get right into NVIDIA and probably more than likely what a lot of us think is going to happen here with NVIDIA. So I think everyone has caught the NVIDIA bug here and really wanting to know what is the next leg going to look like, uh, short term, long term, next five, ten years, what are we looking at here? Uh, so I made a video last week where I said, hey, I, I think NVIDIA is going to keep taking damage. I'm going to be buy, selling, buy, selling and try to really put in some number and just increase my uh, standings in NVIDIA and that's what I've been doing here. So NVIDIA has been following suit. What, what we thought it was going to do, it's doing here and I, I think leading up to the most important thing of the whole video here is that NVIDIA will be releasing their new quarterlies here at the end of this month here in August. So personally I think this is going to be the week where NVIDIA really takes some damage and with that too the market has potential to really suffer this week next week because we have major things going on in the world. We're, we are expecting more bad news with the overall general market. China this week could be talking about some very bad situations in their market which will bleed into everyone's market and we have stuff going on across seas where more guns and bombs will be fired and that will trigger you know just the fears in the market so with that Nvidia will probably take some more damage and two I think the obvious thing right now is that um, you know, corporations, big investors are going to bleed NVIDIA as much as they can leading up to quarterlies. Why is that? Because we know quarterlies are going to be good. That That's pretty much safe and sound. We know quarterlies are going to be good. So I think the big thing that a lot of people are wondering here, can we see NVIDIA bleed back down to $90? But can we actually see NVIDIA go to $80? Would $80 be possible? Imagine buying NVIDIA, and this could be the last time you see NVIDIA at $80 here for years to come. If this is the situation this week or next week where we see NVIDIA go to $80, in, 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 even like a high 80 like $89 would be amazing. Imagine buying NVIDIA at $89, and then at the end of this month, they release a booming monster quarterly to really set off what we know is going to be happening here in the next leg of the stock market going into next year and not only that but AI stocks continue to start to pick up here once again so this is really a key moment for any and everybody whether you're a little investor big investor mid investor this is going to be like if you have a hundred bucks it's really going to double your money here very soon if you have a thousand bucks you're really going to be double quadrupling your money here soon if you have more than that you're talking about some heavy heavy gains here within a year of investing in nvidia so i think it's it's for everyone it, it's for everyone this is stuff you build you build portfolios on your retirement getting in right now um and, and to say nvidia is going to fall down to 80 90 dollars don't look at that and go like that's terrible why would we want that that is great consider this an opportunity you should be praying to god almighty that nvidia goes to 90 to 80 dollars because it's just a short time it's a short time you know you're, you're wanting this why would you want to buy something when it's very high i don't want to buy nvidia at the end of august when it's back up to 130 dollars 140 dollars maybe even more who knows what it could go to here depending on what quarterly show I want to be buying a video when it's having a moment where it's just selling off, it's being traded violently, and there's just fear and the devastation of what's going on in the market. So this, even at $104, I don't think it's a bad buy, but it's just the, it's just the situation of can we get into NVIDIA even cheaper? And I really do believe that we could potentially see NVIDIA fall down to back to the $90 range. It was there last week. We saw it. It went to $93. Um, and then, you know, could we, could we see even lower than that? I, I do believe that we could. Actually, it went to $92. Excuse me. So with NVIDIA having that too, with it having these quarterlies at the end of the month, then on top of that here, another 30 days from that, NVIDIA will be coming out with their new chip. So th these are two big things that are going to be pushing NVIDIA. And this is why big retail investors know this. Big retail, big uh, firms, everything. They know the situation and what's about to happen here. They know that the, if they believe NVIDIA, they, they take profit now, they buy back in lower where the, the stock is being 
being just bled and bled and bled. And they come back in here, they're buying at a low 90, mid 90, maybe a high 80 if we can get to that. And then with all of this stuff that's going to be happening here in the market in probably the next six months, if we don't see some sort of recession or something like that, NVIDIA is going to fly and they're going to quadruple their money. So friends, look at it. You are on a clock right now. You are literally, you know, the, the time is racing against you. You probably have about, I would say safely in the market, you have about 10 safe trading days left in the video where it's going to be very up and down very violent it's going to be at 104 to 99 dollars and then it probably will go back to 107 dollars fall back down to 102 dollars it's going to be very back and forth with traders taking profit and putting it right back in the video if we do see these low 90s people are going to buy back in vigorously and then it's probably going to maybe hopefully drop again to even lower a spot and then that will be the key moment if if nvidia falls to 80 dollars i think that's where you're going to see massive massive buy-ins right there if it even touches an eight it like an 89 88 dollars we're going to see massive massive scooping going on so um i i hope for it because like i said you may not see nvidia at these numbers again until later on in the future when they more than likely we'll have another stock split friends i wish all of you the best of luck with what's with what's coming this week i think it's going to be a very up and down week in the market we're not supposed to have good news and there shouldn't be good news uh this should be a pretty kind of just survival in the market this week that's really probably what we're looking at friends take care i'll talk to you soon bye bye